This is cell 240, also known as Ibis. <laughs> Ibis. More like Ibis seeing, yeah? Bitch. Let's make this quick and simple. Attack patterns and openings. How you go about attacking and penetrating its openings is up to you. But before that, there are two things to keep in mind. Number one, keep moving to the left, okay? To the left, because everything you do in this fight is to the left. Number two is the beep beep dodge. But what is the beep beep dodge? Well, this, my friend, is the beep beep dodge. Beep beep dodge, it's easy. Once you get the hang of it, you can pretty much dodge anything. How about I add some beat to this so it can get a proper say in your head? Well, it looks like I got carried away there for a second during editing, but phase one will always start the same. It's the same drone attack, followed by a sword strike, and the safest way to do a quick boost is forward. By the way, this one right here, right off the bat, is the first opening, and once it lands, that's your second opening. Okay, so the next moves are the hyper beam, I'm not sure what to call it, I'm sorry. The multi hyper beam and the cross sword slash strike, I'm sure you know the one. So be sure to use the beep beep dodge because these are all openings. Also, I'd like to point out that the beep beep dodge will work even if you're close to Ibis or basically any other boss. I guarantee you that this will work. Alright, fine, maybe not guarantee. Uh, I'd say 90% of the time this will work every time that doesn't make sense oh one more thing if you lose track of ibis it will definitely hyper beam your butt next moves in phase one are the boring ones the single strike the single sword strike the double sword strike the triple sword strike there's really no need to go in depth in these ones it's the same thing keep moving left and use the beep beep dodge at this point i'm really sick of saying beep beep dodge i'm gonna call it bb d that still doesn't sound nice. Anyway, these sword strikes are technically openings, but if you're not using a speed mech or a melee build or both, just don't bother. Same goes for the drones Ibis constantly uses throughout the entire fight. Just don't bother with it unless you're doing a no damage speed run or anything like that. And now we're in phase two, where lots of people experience premature celebration. On top of the phase one moves, we also have new ones and let's start off with the easiest one to dodge, the vertical slash sword whip I'm not even sure with these names anymore. Can someone please come up with a better name than Vertical Sword Whip Slash Strike? Oh, good God. This attack is really easy to dodge. You can see it from 100 miles away. And if you get hit by this, I'm sorry. You suck. You're good. You just need more practice, I guess. The opening for this attack is right after the whip hits the ground. So you have about one second before it starts moving again. Next move in phase two is the seven claws of cage of coral claws of cage of... Uh, <laughs> There's really no need to go in-depth into this as well because you can quick boost backwards or just fly straight up and there's your opening right there. This next move, I do have a name for it. It's the uh, the flying coral phoenix flight of... Fuck! Okay, if you're in patch 1.02 or 3 or any future patches, there's no need to complicate things. Just fly straight up, no problem. But if you're still in patch 1.01, you may need to go up a bit quicker or sooner or get a stronger booster because the flight form is the flight form oh my good god the flight form is a bit quicker in patch 1.01 the opening for this move is right after the move ends however this really isn't the best opening and for ibis's final move the most annoying one for sure the claw swipe strike and claw swipe so there are two simple ways to dodge this the first one you fly up you do the beep beep dodge and you fly back up and there's your opening. However, the problem here is you might still get hit by the first strike. The second one is the safest. You quick boost backwards because Ibis will come to you anyway and do the beep beep dodge and you fly up. And once again, there's your opening. And there it is. I'm sure there's a bunch more openings that I didn't know or I didn't mention. If you do know them, please share them in the comments for everyone. Also, it doesn't matter if you're on version 1.01 or 2 or 3. The fight pattern is the same regardless of your version. I know because I spent hours on this guy on day 1 or 2 and winning once wasn't enough for me. Anyway, thank you guys for watching and stay awesome, possum. Awesome.